For Lee and Grant, director John Ayler and producer John Alon Walls wanted to do something a bit different than standard camera moves over photographs, a technique that, though very old, is now popularly called the Ken Burns effect. The look of the title sequence for the HBO series Carnival was discussed, and I did give it a tip of the hat in several sequences. As the visual effects producer for the show, I thought that 2.5D would work nicely for some of the moves. However, it's a fairly well-known technique and we wanted to bring something unique to the show. I created a look using 3D camera projection. The final result brought an uncanny life to the photos, yet hopefully retained the integrity of the original images. In this show, large amounts of information about battle strategy had to be shown on screen. We wanted to update the look from the old standard of lines drawn on maps, yet keep a 19th century feel. I did this entirely in 3D using high resolution images of period maps. I built cards mimicking old postcard photos to act as symbols for troops and generals, as if a war strategy board. Creating this look and using color palettes of the time, I was able to do modern looking flyovers and swoops, yet retain a period look. A lot of real-world enhancement was also done in the show. These are effects that are successful when they're not noticed. Though there were plenty of practical effects, additional blood hits, explosions, and actor duplication was done in this show. All told, there were about 147 shots in the two-hour production, ranging from simple push-ins to real-world compositing, 2D and 3D camera projection to straight-out 3D model building and animation. A mammoth project.